Outdoor Travel Channel with Robin Sherry. Before we get started, please take the time to subscribe, then click on the bell icon to get notified of our future videos. This video is made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available on Amazon right now. Hi guys, this is Rob and welcome to the Outdoor Travel Channel. Today's video is a little bit different than anything I've ever done before and before I start, we need to introduce, this is Cinder. She's our chocolate lab and uh, also our mascot for Ranger Rob Poopy Bags. Anyway, uh, today was kind of interesting. I was talking to my sister and she uh, brought something up. Um, she was having trouble with cold sores and so uh, I thought, you know, there's a couple of things I've been doing I've never shared with anybody. And if this video is helpful to you, uh, I hope, um, it's kind of a courtesy uh, video. And I want to talk about three products that have really helped um, me uh, with health issues. Um, and so I thought I'd share them with you. Some of these you may have heard of, and some of them you may have thought about, and I'm urging you to give them a try. Do a little research. A uh, really good website to check on little things like I'm talking about is uh, The Bright Side. Um, they do a lot of reviews and stuff like this. And uh, Cinder's going to be tapping on me today. She hasn't done a show with me in a while. So the first thing I want to talk about is cold sores. Now, some people really get bad ones inside their mouth or on their lips. Um, it's a normal thing. More than half the population get them. Uh, I've always got them since I was a kid and uh, I never really figured out what causes them to break out or not. Sometimes it's getting too much sun and I get my lips sunburned. Uh, some people have problems with it uh, through stress, things like that, or change of climate, cold temperatures, warm temperatures. And so uh, I've tried the Abreve and I've tried uh, Camp Fulfernique and all that kind of stuff when it happens. I don't get them a lot, but boy, when you get them, they're really irritating and embarrassing. And so I learned about uh, the first product I'm going to talk about is L-Lysine. I don't know if you've ever seen this before. These are just supplemental, um, they say it's kind of like vitamins or supplemental um, things you can take. And L-Lysine, I always get the 1000 milligram. So what it, I don't take these daily. I only take them when I think I'm starting to get a cold sore. And a lot of you people who get cold sores or um, cold blisters in your mouth, you can kind of tell that they're coming. They either itch a little bit or just a little bit of irritation on your lips. I don't get them in my inside my mouth like some people do. But you know what I'm talking about. When you know like, oh crap, it's starting to happen. It's kind of itchy and tender. That's when you want to start taking these. And what I do is take one right away in the uh, morning. Um, and then I try to take one around uh, evening. So I'll take like two a day. Now, I don't know what the, I'm not here to say I'm a doctor or anything like that. I'm just telling you what I do that's helped me. And L-Lysine, it seems to me, um, I don't seem to get the big breakouts anymore. As soon as you know you got one coming, start taking L-Lysine. And it seems for my body, um, it seems to cause it not to go all the way. It kind of makes them stop. Um, and a lot of people, I've actually watched some other videos on this subject, um, will take them um, on a regular basis, a couple a week or something like that. Because uh, if you've already broke out, or already have a cold sore, it doesn't tend to really, they, I think they do help cure them or cause them to heal faster. But usually your breathing and other things are the best for that. But uh, they've said once they started taking L-Lysine, they quit having so many breakouts. And uh, for me, uh, I've never had one really go nuts and break out like I used to when I was younger because I immediately take L-Lysine. So uh, I'll put a link in the description on Amazon. I think you could probably get these, but you can get them at the grocery store. I uh, usually can, if you go to grocery stores, a lot of times you can say buy one bottle, get one free. I don't know exactly what the cost is on these, but uh, it's... Uh, it's a lifesaver. So 
I swear by it and it's worth a try. You guys know how irritating cold sores can be. The next thing I want to talk about is I have dietiticulitis. Everybody has certain things in their lives. Mine is, um, uh, you know, I will get the cramping and things like that and it's uncomfortable and I, I won't go into detail about it, but uh, the cramping is the, the worst part. And uh, so I've always kind of kept an eye out for probiotic type things, uh, um, anything I do to help your gut be healthy. And the next thing I want to tell you about that I take daily, and this has really helped me a lot, and I'm 58 years old, and uh, the cramping, and, and uh, you just have bad days. And, and those of you who may have Crohn's disease or, or diverticulitis, and there's some other forms of uh, gastro kind of issues, uh, I've been taking another supplement, turmeric. We get this signed up on the camera correctly, turmeric. And turmeric, you cook with. <laughs> anyway, there's a lot of research that turmeric can do some really positive things for your your gut, basically. Um, and I take this daily. Um, and I get these, at, um, I'll put a link to these at the in the description. Uh, well, you can probably get them at Amazon, but uh, you can get them at the grocery store. I can get these for a bottle of 60 tablets. Um, I think they're 100 milligrams each. They're pretty big. Uh, they're pretty big. Let me show you. They're, it's just got turmeric in them. And uh, so I got to look at two screens so you can see what I'm seeing. By the way, the L-Lysine tablets are really big too. <laughs> they're like horse tablets. But uh, 100 milligram L-Lysine, by the way, is a pretty big size tablet. Anyway, I'm telling you, they work. Anyway, so the turmeric, uh, which is the same stuff you cook with, some people you can make a little, uh, you can mix it with uh, apple cider vinegar, yuck, uh, and honey and different concoctions. I've tried all those, hard to handle that stuff and the routine. I want something simpler. So I take one of these a day. Oh my gosh, has my issues with diverticulitis gone down from, oh, I bet you 80%, 90% of not cramping issues, making things just so much pleasant in daily life. And uh, so I guess at this age, I always worry about, I don't wanna be one of those people that live on prescriptions and stuff. Um, obviously there's a lot of things in the I need to do like lose weight and stuff like that. I understand that. Um, but uh, anything that you could come up with besides good old fashioned eating well and exercise, um, there, I want to learn that there's a lot of natural things out there that are really good for you. And if you study other countries and stuff, a lot of countries don't have some of the issues we have or uh, because of, of the stuff they eat on a daily basis. Now, the last thing I want to talk about, this is my third item. This amazed me and I just started doing it, but my wife still works. I'm retired and she comes home once in a while with, you know, the sniffles, the cold, the flu, whatever it is. She's the one that brings the diseases home. <laughs> it is not her fault. And so two weeks ago, um, she came home with something, a good head cold. And sure, and I don't usually catch anything, but she, I got this one and it hit me and it really hit me in the sinuses and stuff. And just then I was actually doing it. So, on, and I see, you can find it, like I said, a lot of this information on the bright side, but they're talking about taking, yes, good old whole garlic, good, just old fashioned stuff you see in the grocery store. And, uh, actually eating a clove a day, a clove. So, uh, you know, <laughs> all you do is break these things open, clip off the little ends, peel them, and then uh, <laughs> eat a whole clove. And I like, I feel like crap. I'm, I'm up for it. So I actually I grabbed some garlic, which I already had in my refrigerator, broke open a clove, and uh, <laughs> I break them up in my mouth, but I don't like chew them up big time because that's a hardcore garlic, I'm telling you. And you'll taste garlic for about a half hour to an hour. Um, 
uh, with a little hiccups or anything like that. You go, whoo. Anyway, but uh, I can't believe it. My wife was sicker than a dog for over a week. I shook her bug in two days after that. And so um, one of the things they say about garlic is really good for help uh, help with colds and, and uh, stuff like that. So uh, once I urge you once uh, uh, to get on the internet, do some ho homework uh, and find out what the benefits are about these three things. So I hope that's good information to share with you. I know this is kind of different for the Outdoor Travel Channel, but you know, it's kind of funny. I'm just sitting on this little gold mine of uh, things that really helped me. And you, once you know, it's a paradigm shift type of thing. You've got to learn how to uh, uh, do this every day. But l lysine only when you think you're getting cold sores. Uh, Turmeric is really good for your gut and a lot of other issues. I urge you to do some homework. And good old fashioned garlic. I don't take it every day. It's only when I'm picking up a cold. I have a day I'm not feeling very well. It seems to get me over things fast. So uh, I'm really happy because they're natural products. So uh, anyway, I hope that's been helpful to you. I hope you don't mind us doing a video like this. I know this is Outdoor Travel Channel, but hey, you can't enjoy the outdoors if you're not feeling well. And if you're traveling a lot and stuff like this, this stuff is available to you anywhere you go in the United States in other countries too. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I hope this has been a good video for you. Thanks. Bye now. Thank you for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over. Then go down to the description and think about becoming a member of our Patreon. This will allow you to get special content just for you and help us build future content. Thank you.